works and hello welcome to my channel if you are new here welcome back if you've been here before so today's guy today's video guys is a cabbage patch doll haul and also guys i have some books to haul at the end of the video that are american girl so this is an american girl slash cabbage patch haul now guys um these dolls are meant to be my christmas present with everything going on, sorry guys, in the middle of changing my bed sheets and everything that went on, I wasn't able to clean these dolls. And this is going on. I'll tell you all in a minute if I can. Hold on, guys. So there are my American girls in the background. Guys, these dolls were adopted October 19th for Christmas. You can see how dirty they are, guys. I'm just sitting in my room being another hassle for me to trip over. So guys, the dolls are really pretty. These two are twins. Everybody does have a name, and a matter of fact, uh, well, I want to do a fixing up video, a fixing up series on them. Guys, I have my bed disarrayed because I'm in the middle of doing laundry. I wanted to do a fixing up my cabbage patch to house video, and because I think it's in the family's list, fixing up my art generations, Madden Alexanders, and American Girls. Oh, they're really pretty. Um, my dad gave me always get, once in a while, like around the holidays or my birthday, gives me some money and tells me, "Get something from me for Christmas or your birthday." Ew, she is touching my jacket. Fine. Oh, Shauna, her hair's touching. Look how crusty she is. Poor little queen is. Guys, I don't like to leave my cabbies dirty. So, guys, I figured out how. We figured out what is wrong with the basement when I had to wash laundry down there. The laundry tub is cracked. So we were in the process of getting a new one fixed because I slipped down there. But anyway, so I'm going to put a bucket down there for now because these dolls, these poor dolls have been sitting here and need to be cleaned. I'm in the middle of calling a plumber next couple of days because I got to get this house fixed up again. But uh, something serious happened. So why if I seem a little weird, guys? Whew, I've had a bad night. You hear screams like that and find your 90-year-old father on the ground, that you would be too. My father fell. He was cleaning and went to mop the floor. So, guys, I'm filming on the tablet I played The Sims on. I, my other tablet is probably ruined. And I don't care, guys. I'd rather have it be ruined than Dad. Can you guys believe he cared more about that stinking tablet than himself? Turning himself? Like, yes, guys, my tablet was probably ruined, but it's just all right. Dad, Dad, I'll buy you a new one. I'm like, Dad, I don't care about that stinking tablet. I heard about my 90-year-old father when my athene grabbers and cancer are falling. Look, guys, Dad's going to love her. This this girl, her grandpa's going to love these guys. My dad is proudly still to read her faces. Like he already said they're his grandchildren. These guys are like one year old, I think, because this is a boy, by the way. I don't know why some girls have it. So, I know my business. <laughs> I think I paid seven across the board, seven ninety nine across the board. Yes, this is an infant, guys. You know what's funny? My mom bought one like this for my cousin Norma back in nineteen eighty something. Wow, well, long time before Borkson was born. Anyway, guys, when I was looking through family Christmas pictures, which I normally do at Christmas time, I like to look at pictures of the boys. And plus, thinking of the boys does make my three cousins that are no longer here that my dad was raising, my parents were raising before my brother was born. Before me and my brother were born, so my dad does still like to have like pictures of the boys, like, pictures of all of us up from Christmas time. And so their picture is behind my brother's baby picture. Anyway, guys, dad was looking at the pictures. He was reminiscing about the boys and that Christmas and all. And Christmas is he had spent with the boys. And it was Norma was holding a cabbage patch that all looked exactly like this. I couldn't see her name, but I probably would have named her after the doll. I don't know if Norma would remember her name. I would like to have named my cabbage patch doll after that one. That would have been cool. So guys, they're really cute. They're really dirty. So guys, I don't, this one, oh, guys, look, his feet are fine. He just got little booties on. He's got little booties on. Mommy wants to check his little feet out. And ma'am, the only one with shoes. He's the only boy out of this group. So guys, it's time I start cleaning up all my cabbage patch dolls because Abigail's hand got a little dirty. I do play with her and I do like snuggle with her and stuff. My cabbage patch dolls down there at Abby. That's probably why. Guys, look, one of them came with two pacifiers. The one of the twins, I think she came with two pacifiers. So I gave the other pacifier to the other little girl. So these two are twins. These twins. They look similar to Danielle. 
which I hope is not the case. They look too much like Danielle. That might be. No, guys, Danielle has like stains on the inside, but look how cute they are. Okay, guys, I'm gonna show you guys the books I got as well. So, guys, these are some of the books my dad got me for Christmas. You guys actually have a Meet Julie B Forever book because, sorry, guys, it's my bag of clothes I got for Christmas. And Max, I'm washing everything. I got a Be Forever version, and I have a Be Forever version of another Julie book. It's my collections downstairs. Really, really cute. I wanted this book because I might eventually want to get Julie from American Girl. I don't own, I don't have Julie yet. Julie and the Eagles, which to me just makes me awful. Okay. Oh my gosh, she's about the Eagles. Look at her. She knows she's not in Pennsylvania. Guys, this is my Susie Dolls box, so please excuse that. Happy New Year, Julie. Really cute. Julie's journey. I know Julie likes to play baseball. Uh, soft, I'm um, sorry, guys. It's football. Boards and stuff. Julie, in her story, she does like to play basketball. Now, funny thing is, guys, my mom actually played basketball. My mom got, like, a jacket in school for playing basketball and stuff. I couldn't throw a hoop to save my life. I'm very, very short, wide-hipped girl, so I couldn't play sports. But you know what, you guys? That's sorry. Sorry, guys. I'm showing you guys my other dolls. Okay, guys, I will probably be doing a fixing up on these dolls. I threw the bag that belongs to those books. You guys, my coat fell too, so. so let's do a video where I show the dolls before. She has a little bonnet. Actually, guys, my, my dad has a video of me and my bonnet when I was a little girl. When I was, sorry, guys, keep showing my other stuff again. Dolls. My Nick unit when I was in the bonnet. Those guys. In the Nick unit, my little bonnet. And my brother jokingly said, I'm throwing her out of dread. She looks stupid. Fun fact, guys, I still have some of my baby stuff from the Survive the Fire. From my, my actual baby stuff from I was a baby. And I still have some of my baby dolls, too. Okay, guys. Like I said, this might be my only tablet left, so I have to go check on my other one. But remember to comment, like, share, subscribe. Remember, guys, always love the cabbies and the American Girl dolls. To my next uploaded video, I love you all. Bye, guys.